Damn, this card, you know, it's not, it's, it, you know, it's Marlon Vera versus Corey Sandhagen. That's what I'm excited about. I, I'm very excited about that fight. I rewatched Corey versus Song Yidong again. Corey's good, dude. He's so fast. He's quick. He's, he can move backwards. He's good at not getting hit. Um, and then there's Cheeto, who's good at getting hit. Very good at getting hit. Which he absorbs. He doesn't really take a ton of damage, though. He'll get hit, but he just, he wears it good and it doesn't really phase him. He keeps walking forward. Um, very interesting matchup. Very interesting matchup. I keep going back and forth. I'm like, God. And I wonder what size cage it's in, dude. And P- I, I know I bring it up a lot, and I brought it up last time, po- last podcast, I think. Mm-hmm. Dude, if you play in a basketball game, they're like, let's just let's play half court. <laughs> it's a different sport, yeah. dude. You change one thing about it, it's a different sport. And uh, I don't think people really understand that or realize that, how big the, guy, the, the normal size octagon is, the small cage sucks get it out of there they don't need that why do we have it it's dumb it's not real yeah. it's fake fake news um that's why i'm gonna get this fucking real size cage in my barn dominium it's not even a barn dominium anymore it's a fucking house but uh yeah uh marlin versus Corey, five fives uh in texas oh man ah, both these dudes are in their fucking prime um what, what are you what are you thinking 30 years old yeah, they're both 30 dude they're in their prime i just keep going back and you can i can picture it similar ways to how Cheeto has won his last couple fights. Wear him down, wear him down, boom, hit a big shot or two, Yeah, get a finish potentially. And I, But then I just see Corey with how good he is and how should technic- how technical he is. And he doesn't get hit as much as some of these other guys yeah. Cheeto has fought. And so I, I could see Corey edging out a decision. I don't know. What what about their jiu-jitsu? Do you know any either thing about their, either their jiu-jitsu? Really, does one of them have a bigger advantage um, on that? It's hard to say. I think they're both pretty good on the ground. I mean, the thing is, it's not a jiu-jitsu fight. How's their MMA jiu-jitsu? That's a good question. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. We really haven't seen too much. I know Cheeto has a couple sweet subs. I know Corey uh, armbarred Mario. Yeah. That was a super short notice fight for Mario, and Mario has improved ton since then but yeah it, it's hard to say i'd probably give the edge to cheeto he's probably a little bit stronger uh, and, and maybe a little bit more skilled in straight jiu-jitsu but really i don't know Corey was cory shot a lot against song like a lot he he shot probably 10 times or oh really you know, yeah the first couple minutes he shot three or four times or the first round i should say um will he shoot on cheeto Cheeto's dangerous. He's pretty dangerous off his back. He doesn't mind going to his back. That's how Frank Edgar beat him until he didn't. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm I'm excited for the fight. I really don't know. Like I said, I went back and forth. Cheeto, yeah, could stalk him down, crack him, land a couple big shots, and uh, get the job done. Or Corey could dance on him for 50, 25. And that does take a – if it is in a small cage, Corey's – I mean, Cheeto's going to be able to cut him off easier, not as much. Yeah. It's in Texas live crowd. I don't think it's going to be in a yeah. smaller cage. Probably but it could bigger. be. I don't know. Um, we'll see. God, it's gonna be exciting. Whatever happens, though, it's gonna. I, be, I mean, uh, you had I Peter versus Marab, which you could have guessed it could potentially be a sl- slow, boring Marab fight. Yeah. But this one should be just bang, bang yeah, from the get go. Just. Whew. I think so. Or Corey doesn't engage too much. He, you know, he, I don't. Know. I don't think that's the case. I think it's gonna be a yeah, an epic fight. Um, Interesting, you know, Corey uh, Henry versus Aljo May six still there. No one's pulled out of that yet. Um, I'm still preparing as much as I possibly can to, you know, if the call, if they call, Col- Colby weighed in. How yeah, random that was, was that? Really weird. Apparently, Kamara and Leon knew, but I don't know why they. It wasn't. I guess apparently it, they did know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. They knew the, like a long time ago that he was going to weigh in as a backup. <laughs> I don't know why they didn't disclose it to the UFC. I mean, to the fans. Thought that was kind of interesting. Yeah, yeah, it's su- yeah. I don't know. That's weird. I guess. Do they usually? Sometimes I feel like they do. They're like, yeah, this could be back up. 